My name is Hai Ge. My name is Liu Zewen. Feng Jiachen. Zheng Juzhi. Liu Xinran. Yan Huhe. Xu Guohao. Jing Jiwen. Wu Ai. During Chinese New Year, international students at Columbia University had their name tags torn off in an act of racism. This has inspired several Chinese students fight back with the campaign "Say My Name" about the meaning of their names. Even at UC Berkeley, some international students feel embarrassed when peers and professors repeatedly mispronounce their names in class. Instead of correcting people's pronunciations on this, many international students decide to simply adopt English names so that their peers and professors may more easily remember their names. This is Paulina Jing. This is Shukima with Cal TV. With approximately 42% of Cal students identifying as Asian, any unfair treatments to Asian populations come back to affect a significant portion of the student body. 咁你點解會改英文名？啊，因為啲教授唔識讀。我中文名。呃，因为中文名可能大家并不知道指的具体是哪一个汉字，或者是说某一些呃外国人他呃他这个读讲我的中文名肯定讲的不是很好，所以我觉得用英文名大家记忆记得记住了我的人会更多，会更快一点。嗯，所以你觉得在美国用英文名字还是比较方便？对，是在美国用英文名还是比较方便。嗯 In 2009, Betty Brown, a former Texas state representative, came under fire after suggesting the voters of Asian descent adopt English names that are easier for Americans to deal with. 咁你会觉得有一个中文名喺度会比较难揾工啲咧？诶，都会嘅，因为雇主应可能知道你唔系呢度出世嘅人啦。咁會覺得你啲英文好似唔係咁好喎，咁樣就可能會難請啲咁樣咯。都唔會嘅，係睇你自己嘅能力啫。咁你可以有亞洲嘅性，同時即係你嘅能力亦都係非常好，同埋你英文都係講得好好啊。咁又冇冇咩問題。NPR reported that a study from Ryerson University and the University of Toronto showed that job applicants with Asian first names were 28% less likely to be called in for job interviews compared to their English named counterpart. Um, what do you think we can do、um, as a society to make sure that we eradicate this kind of behavior? I think awareness is one of the most important things. International students feel pressure to assimilate into American culture. Keeping their given name is a choice that they are forced to make when coming to study in the United States, leading some to feel like they are abandoning where they come from. What these dilemmas boil down to is whether or not they feel they belong. Paulina Jing and Shukima reporting for CalTV News.